Tough angle shot. Sails wide. Picked up right wall shot by Gannon. And blocked down. Picked up side of the net. Wrap around. Score! And the Admirals wasting little time. Troy Bodie at the post. Able to tuck it around the pipe on the glove side of McElhenney. It takes only 38 seconds. But They've got Gannon and Lindholm now working there. Here is Gannon high slot with a shot. Deflection mid-air and a score! Nate Gannon's shot was redirected in flight and ends up behind McElhenney, a power play goal. Admirals win this face off. Matt Clark with a shot, a bouncing shot. Knocked down, tipped in at the side of the net by Chris Wagner. Second goal as a professional for the former Colgate product. Chris Wagner and the Admirals skating four aside have tied the game at 1-1. Dayton made the initial save, but Wagner just to the right of the Falcon netbinder. Kurtz has somebody by the jersey. And it looks like Kurtz might drop the gloves. He will, and John Kurtz is going to go at it, along with, I believe, Michael Chapool. Kurtz knocked down to his knees, gets back up. Kurtz with his helmet off, trying to push. A big uppercut there from Kurtz may have grazed Chapool. And then Chaput trying to wrestle him down. Kurtz brings him back up. Kurtz trying to unload with a right hand. And down goes Chaput. John Kurtz is going to develop quite a fan following in Hampton Roads if he keeps doing that. Kurtz not exactly what you would call a heavyweight, probably more like a middleweight, but. He's got a thunderous right hand. Moving ahead, Palmieri back to Holland, left side ring, open shot, score! All hands on deck as Peter Holland. As the Admirals get back to even strength, draw back within one here in the middle of period two. Team leading seventh goal for Peter Holland.